Vivian passed away a, a was it a couple of years ago? Can you tell me a little bit about her? It was over Christmas, actually. Yeah. Is it? Yeah, that's right. It was recently. So tell me a little bit about what made Viv so special. Well, she was a very determined, single-minded, talented lady who kind of knew what she wanted and went for it. Um, I actually went to China, I don't know, about eight or nine years ago to do something in Shanghai. I got there. In the early hours of the morning, it dawned on me that the airport was quite a long way from town. And I thought well, I'd have a cup of coffee. I thought, oh, that's not bad. I'll have another one. And I was a bit kind of caffeined up. Got to the hotel at like 6.30 in the morning and thought, checked in. And I thought, oh, actually, I'm a bit buzzing from this coffee. I might as well go for a little walk because I won't sleep. And that's what I did. And I thought, oh, I better not get lost. Let's find a landmark. And I looked round outside the hotel, and there, in Shanghai, was a Vivian Westwood flagship store. And I, I never expected that at all. But it was like, wow, right from the early days when I worked for them, and it was like kind of hand-to-mouth, and I'd have to sell a couple of things to buy some more material for something else. She built up this business empire all around the world on her own terms, you know, with a particularly kind of wacky cool brand you know it, it, with Vivian stuff you couldn't just wear one or two bits right you had to wear the whole kit and caboozle otherwise it don't work and, and yeah so there you go but I was lucky enough not long before I came away to America to go to to be invited and go to Vivian's memorial at Southwark Cathedral and just but everybody but everybody from the whole fashion world was there um yeah it was quite an eye opener how well respected she was and, and musicians as well i mean chrissy ein sang a song she sang raining in my heart she was good friends for her and got choked up halfway through she was doing it with the guitarist um james Wilburn, and then um, nick caves played the piano and sang a fantastic song Oh, for Vivian, we'd much rather still have her around, but 